Hey everybody, in this section we will talk about layout design and how we could design desktop application using Python. What I mean by desktop application, if you search in your, in your Windows or Mac for calculator, you will see application like have a layout, you could interact with this layout and when you click something, he will do process for you and give you a result. So to just give you an overview about what we mean by uh, this application it is very very basic thing it's just simple layout that someone designed it and when for example if you interact with this layout by clicking a three multiply by four and you click equal he will send all this information to the normal function written in any language maybe maybe objective c maybe swift maybe python and that function will do addition and it will give you the result back so one thing this layout could could do for you is just sh showing you a result and getting your inf input information from you the idea from the building this type of application it's for user experience, so it is really, really hard for users if he try to import and enter the information directly from the screen, from the black screen or whatever, which is very hard. So, what interesting here, Python used library named tkenter. This tkenter is supported by Windows, Mac, Linux, because it's just internally he using specific shell scripting. That is mean, if you develop this application in Python, it will work on Windows or Mac or Linux, which is the great news. So one application works across platform. So this is the good benefit of ROM TK Enter. So to get started, I will in the search, uh, search for IDLE, I think, yes. So IDLE, this is something provided with Python when you install Python. This already been installed, if it's in Windows or Mac. If I open it, the last version I have is 3.6, maybe you have a newest version. If you see it here, so TKenter already shipped it with Python. To make sure you uh, TKenter already shipped it, just look for right here import TKenter. Then click enter. If you move, that's great. Again, now do what you have to do. Just write import underscore TKenter. Okay, or under slash. So TKenter. So this is second import. So now you have two import. Now just to do test, I will write TK enter. Then I write dot, then underscore or under slash. I don't know what you name it. Then test, then open a bracket, close it. Then you click enter. If you show you this screen, this desktop screen, maybe it doesn't show here, it will appear down. So that is mean you are great. That's this uh, TK enter already shipped to their Python and it installed. It's by default shipped with Python 3.6 and after. So if you're using 3.6 and after, that's totally okay. It's already shipped in either, either in Windows or Mac. So if you see, when I track this layout, you will do some process for me. So basically make sure from your uh, setup for TK Enter to working. It should work, So, but test it. If it is fine, that's great. Go to the next step.